Ashwin, you know, you were part of the meeting which Modi ji had organized for the for all of you. I'm not talking about this. I'm not talking about this. Okay, if you're not comfortable, fair enough. Bye. Thank you so much. Thank you so much for talking to us. Yeah, it's okay. Cut, 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 cut. Well, it was quite surprising to see that Ashwini Iyer didn't want to talk on that meeting they had with PM Narendra Modi. I mean, if I remember, that meeting was fruitful for Bollywood, where GST rates were increased for the entertainment industry. But nevertheless, our reporter didn't have a question complete. But the question was merely going to be that if you get a chance to meet PM Narendra Modi again, will you talk to him about the protest that's going on? And uh, she being one of the prominent faces and representatives from Bollywood, female representative from Bollywood. It was really important uh, to kind of have a dialogue, a discussion on this. But nevertheless, surprising to see that she didn't really want to answer that. But what Ashwini Ayer did answer and gave her opinion on is on the protest uh, against the violence on the students and professors at the JNU University. Let's hear what she has to say. Ashwini, you know, we, uh, you just mentioned uh, previously that youth, jo young uh, students in India, ke, they, those are the future. And today, right now, as we talk in our country, you know, uh, in Delhi, uh, students from JNU and other colleges were treated with some brutality, you know, uh, recently. Uh, as, uh, as someone who was a well-known director, as someone who is like one of the voices of the film industry, uh, I want to know your views uh, on, the, on the incident that took place. It's heartbreaking. It's heartbreaking. This is the first time I'm actually talking about it. Okay. It's heartbreaking. I feel that in any kind of situation, we need to first have dialogues. Mm. Violence is not the solution. solution. Dialogue is the solution. Yeah. And I just put a quote today uh, of saying that, you know, walk hand in hand and go home together. Mm. Mm. Lead the way. And uh, that's all it is. Once we, we can have dialogues and once we have dialogues, things will start blooming in. Mm. Mm. And uh, yes, it, it, it's, it's depressing. Well, that's what Ashwini Ayer thinks. There needs to be a dialogue, a discussion, and uh, people need to walk hand in hand. Uh, he says that the protests are going on are quite depressing. But in this uh, music launch event, there was a surprising thing that Kangana Ranaut uh, cancelled the media interaction. Now, uh, our sources and our reporters on ground, on field, they had confirmed that Kangana Ranaut was going to have a media interaction at the song launch event, but it came to a surprise to everyone and a shocker to everyone. And that's why it was quite surprising to see Kangana Ranaut cancel media interaction, a woman who's known to speak her mind, an actress who's bold in her statements. CAA ke protest ke time par, she did speak up. Uh, she was for CAA. She told everyone to believe in the leader. And we were fine with her opinion. That was absolutely her opinion, but at least she spoke up. But uh, when the music launch event par unhane media interaction cancel kar di, uh, we really were quite surprised and shocked and we really hope that she comes and clarifies ki unhone ye uh, step kyun li ha? because uh, Kangna Ranaut that she is, vocal that she is, we really expected uh, a statement out of her kyunki of course like we say when Bollywood celebs talk, the protest goes mainstream. And we highlighted once again whether a Bollywood celebrity wants to talk for or against is their choice but at least speak up.